What's up everybody? It's Tom Sons of Buster coming at you with another video. And in this video, we're going to be talking about the first step on how I'm getting my money back, okay? You may be new to the Discord. You may be new to the channel. If you are, please like, subscribe, and all that other great YouTube stuff for me. It helps the channel. And today, I want to talk about what will your first step be. If you want to take the 5K in 30 day challenge, or maybe you only have 100 and you're trying to build that a small account up, so go 100 to 500 in 30 day challenge, all right? And believe me, that's a big increase in profits if you can go from 100 to 500. But to be successful, you're going to have to learn a couple of rules. And when I say rules, I mean they become commandments to you people. If you don't understand these principles that I'm going to be showing you, you will never be a successful trader. And you will blow up your account, I would know, three, four, and five times trying to be successful in trading options. But there are reasons why. 90% of the people who invest in options fail, and it's because they do not ever learn the principles that I'm about to show you. All right, so the first step in being successful and getting your account from, from 1,000 to 5K in 30 days is going to be to learn how to set your risk. All right, setting a risk. And then once you learn what your risk is, people, you write that down, that becomes your commandment. You can never break that no matter what. Because if you do, there's a high probability you're going to blow up your account and become one of the 90% that never succeed. Now, we've taken our account from 1,000 to 1,847. All right, so that'll be what I'm using in this example. But to learn how to set your risk, First thing you want to do is write down, go to your broker and write down what your account balance is going to be. All right. If you've got a thousand dollars and you want to try to turn that into five thousand, or you got a hundred dollars and you want to try to turn that into five hundred dollars, then whatever is in your account, you write that number down. Then, this is kind of where I veer off from the professionals because I'm more of an aggressive investor, but you will never, ever, ever go above 15% of your account balance on any options trade. That way, if you blow it up, then you only blow up 15% and you still got 85% that you can work with the next day, okay? So, in my case, we're going to say that the balance is $1,847. And then the question that you have to ask next is, what is 15% of 1847 And you say, well, CSI, I'm not good at doing percents and figuring out what the percents are. That's very cool. Don't worry about it. You just run over here to Google. And you type in 15% of whatever your account balance is. And it's going to tell you what the answer is. So in my case, 15% of $1,847 is $277. So I'm going to write that down, $277. That is the most I will spend on any set of options. I can divide that in half and get two contracts. I can do it in thirds and get three contracts, but I will never go over the 15%, that's allotted. Now, if it's a scalp and it's a win, and I'm out, I'm good. If it goes against me, well, we just have to pray that it goes back up before the end of the day or the end of the next week whenever you buy your options. But you will never lose more than that on any given trade that you do. All right? Now, now in my particular case, I've got $277. That is my risk tolerance. I'm not going to go over that on any trade. So I know I could spend $277 on one contract. I could spend $138 for two contracts. 
or I could spend 92 I could buy 92 cent options and get three of them for two hundred and seventy seven dollars see it it's and that's I really like to do that and I'm gonna show you later on when I'm using an example that I'm gonna get three contracts of something and I'm still gonna stay inside of my risk level okay so with that let this be your number one lesson that's the very first thing you're going to do is establish your risk in the trade all right so with that love y'all be blessed get ready i'm gonna go ahead and do a couple more videos for y'all this morning and i'll see you in the next video